What's going on everyone? Steven here. Today I'm going to show you how to have infinite ammo in Borderlands 3. Now this one has a bunch of complicated stuff going on if you try to do things the normal way. So I'm going to show you a quick easy hack to, uh, you know, do away with all the craziness that happens if you normally try to hack it. So by all means, if you are an experienced game hacker, go ahead and give it a shot yourself before watching this video. Um, and if all you want is the cheat, then check out the description below. I'll have a link to my Borderlands 3 cheat table so that you can just go and enable whatever you want. So with that said, uh, let's just go ahead and get started here. Um, you can pick any gun. So with this gun that I have, my current ammo is 16. So I'm just going to do an initial scan for 16, just a four byte scan. And once that's done, I'm going to take a couple of shots. So now I'm at 14. All right. And see these values that are changing. It's going to be one of these two. All right. So now what I'm going to do is try to put 16 here and see what happens. All right. Let's try to put 16 in this one and see what happens. All right. So it did go up to 16. We fired a shot, which took it back down to 15. So this one is our ammo. So you'll notice one funky thing that's going on. If we lock this value and start shooting, our max ammo on the right starts going down. All right. So this is what I was saying. There's all kinds of funky stuff going on right now. Um, but we're just going to cut through all that. So let's see what writes to this address. And once that pops up, toggle this or resize it. There we go. All right. So now I'm going to fire a shot. All right. So I'm going to reload. All right. So this particular instruction right here, we're going to go show disassembler. And now what I'm going to do is right click on it and choose select current function. All right. And that's going to select this entire function. So all that we want to do right here, we can look at the bottom of the function or the end of the function and see how it returns. So we see that, you know, after it gets done popping everything and whatever it needs to do in the epilogue of the function, we just have a regular ret. So that's byte C3. So what we can do is just go to the prologue of this function right here, and we can just put a return here. All right. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to double click on that, copy this, All right. or actually DB4053. Those are the two bytes that we see here. And I'll just copy those so that I can have them to put back if I want. And instead, I'm going to do C390. All right, so now here's a ret. Now if I come back in here, I can just shoot, 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 and everything's fine. And now I can hit R to reload. All right, and our max ammo will still go down, so that'll be something that, you know, I'll leave it to you to search and deal with. Um, but our main ammo is infinite. And additionally, I don't know if this will have what it, I want, but um, you can still gain ammo and it will increase your max ammo. So we have done away with, uh, you know, current ammo subtraction. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Quick, easy cheat there. So now what we can do is I'm going to paste these back. All right. And we just say no there. So we can go to, uh, if we want to make this a more lasting and uh, cheat, rather, tools, auto assemble, template, AOB injection. All right, we can just say OK here. And then we can put inf ammo here. Hit OK. All right, and since we don't need to like jump to any new places in memory, we're just wanting to write new bytes to this spot can do away with all this stuff here and then what we can say is inf ammo db c390 all right and we can get rid of this dialic 
and we can get rid of these four bytes. Technically we don't need to write this byte because it's going to hit the C3 and just immediately return, but you know, since those two bytes comprise this instruction, that's why I'm doing that. So the AOB scan will happen here and apply this label. We can register the symbol and, you know, yeah, all that good stuff. So anyway, if you want, instead of doing the AOB scan, you can just put this exact module plus offset in place of that. So instead of uh, the AOB scan, you could just define inf ammo. Um, uh, or let's see. Oops, I hit insert. Uh, define inf ammo this particular spot right here. And now it knows that inf ammo is this exact point. Uh, this module plus offset. So if we go to enable it, we go to file assigned current cheat table, close that, close this, go to enable it, there we go, it's enabled, let's disable it, everything's fine. So that's pretty much what I already had here in the infinite ammo because I went ahead and found this beforehand, but I'll just keep the AOB scan just in case. So let me enable that and sometimes you'll notice it takes a good bit longer because it has to scan for that byte pattern. So anyway, there you go. That's uh, Infinite Ammo. Um, check out my Borderlands 3 Cheats playlist in the description below. I'll also have the cheat table linked so you can just go download that and check it out. I've got plenty more videos on this coming in the very near future. So thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you on the next one. Take care.